secret message with invisible ink. <gasps> yeah, I know. Julia, have you ever made a secret message before? No. <laughs> this is like a really cool science chemistry experiment that we're working with pH. That's something that's really an advanced concept for a little kid like you, but I'm gonna teach you all about it today yep. while we're making our secret message. Are you guys ready to see what's in our kit today? Yes. Okay. Two pieces of cardstock, a paper towel, hand sanitizer, a sponge brush, a paintbrush, a popsicle stick, turmeric, baking soda, and one cup. This looks like so much fun. We have so much stuff in our kit today. Yeah. Okay, on top of everything in your kit, you'll just need some water, and then we're ready to get started. Yep. <laughs> okay, Juliet, get your cup. We're gonna fill our cups about halfway with water. See that? Okay, now take your baking soda, and that's your white powder right there. White powder. Uh-huh, and we're going to put it in our cup. All of it goes in. Good job. Now we're just gonna get our paintbrush, the small paintbrush that we have, and we're gonna stir that up. So right here, Juliet, we're making a base. That's what this is called, a base. And later on, we're going to put something on this base that's going to react and cause a chemical change to occur. It's gonna be so fun. Okay, so we have our base mixed up. Get your cardstock. Now we have two pieces of cardstock, so that means you can write two secret messages. We're gonna do this project over a piece of paper towel. Yes. Um, if you don't have your paper towel anymore for some reason, you can use a cloth or another kind of towel that you have. If at any time in this Winkle video we get going too fast, you can always pause the video and press play when you're ready to catch up. Also, if you missed any instructions, you can always rewind the video and press play and watch it again. Now let's give that another stir just in case that baking soda settled in again. We've got to make it nice and mixed. Okay, so on mine, I'm going to write a letter to a friend. I'm going to write a letter to mommy. Okay, so you, you won't be able to see it. You'll just be able to see the wetness. And it can't be a very long letter because we have a paintbrush and the words are kind of thick because of the paintbrush. It's not like a pencil, which is really thin. The paintbrush is gonna let you do probably like 10 words or something like that, or, or less, okay? So think of a message you can do that's short, a short message. And keep dipping your paintbrush back in the base. This is our base right here. You can kind of still see the message. Yep, it's drying up. And you can do little designs on your card too if you want, like hearts or swirls. Okay, are we done with the first secret message? Yes. Okay, mine is a secret for a secret friend of mine. Yes. I'm gonna put it over here. Oh, yours is too? Okay, and then we're gonna write our second message. Okay. You could write it to the same person or to a different person, it's up to okay. you. I'm gonna write mine to Daddy. Oh, that's a good idea. I was thinking of writing mine to my dad too. <laughs> okay. Okay, our secret messages are done. They look great. We're gonna set them aside to dry while we're mixing our reagent. Okay, in this part, you wanna make sure to do over your paper towel as well. You're gonna open up your hand sanitizer <laughs> carefully. See, there's that little tab right there that helps you open it. Good, set it down. And this is turmeric. It's actually a seasoning and a spice. And we're gonna open that up, pour that into the hand sanitizer, which is alcohol-based. Okay, and just give it a little flick like that. Yep, little tap. Okay, so this solution will actually stain, so you have to be very careful not to get it on your clothes. Or, or your hands. Yeah, if you get it on your hands, you can always wash it off. But we don't want to get it on your clothes or like the table or anything like that. Yeah, because it will stain the table. Yeah, did you mix it with your popsicle stick? Whoa. Yeah, it's a cool color, right? Uh-huh. Okay, no. okay, while your secret message is drying, I want you to put the lid back on our reagent that we made because that'll keep it protected from spills until we're ready to use it. Okay. 
Okay, Juliet, we waited and our secret messages are finally dry. Are you ready to see what they are? Yeah. Okay, I actually have one for you that I want to give you a secret message. I have one that <gasps> I want to give to you. You do? Oh, thank you. I'm so excited about it. Guys, remember this is our reagent and it stains, so we have to be very careful when we're brushing it on. If your two messages are for a different person, that just means you need to keep your lid on your reagent and save it. So that when the next person wants to reveal their secret message, they can use it, okay? Okay. All right, carefully take your lid off. Put the lid on your paper towel. All right, we're gonna dip our sponge brush into our reagent. pH indicators, remember I was talking about pH before? They change color based on the acidity of the substances they are exposed to. They basically undergo a chemical reaction that causes a change in color. Look at that. Turmeric is a natural indicator, so it changes color when the turmeric and rubbing alcohol is mixed with a baking soda. Whoa. Look at that. Look at that. That is this. so cool. This is chemistry happening right in front of your eyes. It looks like it's magic, doesn't it? Yeah. This is awesome. So awesome, not really awesome, so awesome. The best, this is the best ever. Okay, what does mine say? Mom, I love you and do you want to snuggle? Yes. Yes? <laughs> okay, let's read what yours says. Mine says, Julia, I love you. Thank you. Thanks. Thanks for doing the winkle. <laughs> You're so good about helping me with winkle stuff. Yeah. Okay, you don't want to lay your sponge brush on your turmeric solution okay. because it might knock it over. So if you need to put it somewhere, put it on your lid. So what did you think of this project today? It was so fun. It was super fun, the best, right? A uh -huh. secret message. Yeah. So cool. So you guys could do this again and again at home. Remember we just used the baking soda mixed with water. Yes. That was our base. And then our reagent was turmeric, which is a seasoning you can get at the store, mixed yes. with hand sanitizer, which yeah. we have a lot of that right now because of um, COVID, COVID, right? Yeah. <laughs> we know all about hand sanitizer. Yeah. So keep your lid. You're gonna take your, your sponge brush and wash that out. Put the lid onto your reagent. We're gonna wash this out and use it later for your next secret message to go to your next person. Mine is for my dad, and Juliet's is for her dad. Yeah. I'm gonna give them to them for Father's Day. They're gonna yes. love it. Thanks for joining us today, everybody. This was so much fun. If you like this video, please press like and subscribe. That way, every time we come out with new Winkle videos, you'll be the first to know. Also, check out down below for freebies and thewinkle.com. Juliet, would you love to see how our friends' messages turned out? Yeah. Me too. If you have a grown up take a picture of you doing your project and they post it on social media, have them tag us at the Winkle Crate. That way we can see what you made and how it turned out. <laughs> Good job today, Juliet. This was so much fun. Thanks for joining us. Bye.